hello friends welcome back to the domain racer and this video is going to evaluate how do you scan your website for the viruses malware and vulnerability in your code also it helps you to prevent your website or wordpress blog from getting hacked so this video is for you so please do watch this video so you can able to scan your website for malware viruses or vulnerability in your source code so let's begin with the process the scanning part is very simple okay so you need a virus scanner or a malware scanner or a vulnerability scanner but in this case you do not need that you just have to go to the domain racer and log in into your c panel when you are in the c panel just you have to scroll down to the bottom and look for the security sections and click on cp guard okay one more thing before moving further please do watch uh, another video about how do you protect your wordpress from the attack or a security of wordpress we have already created a video on this please watch that video first and then you can continue this video because if you secure your wordpress then you can able to avoid unnecessary reflections toward your website so that way you can able to securize your wordpress now we will move further for the c panel based cp guard virus scanner malware scanner and even if it helps you to avoid the threads in the wordpress so let's begin with the process very first i will show you how you can able to scan your viruses so just you have to go to the manual scan and here you can able to directly click on run scan or you can able to also scan a particular direct so both options are available but if you wanted to scan a particular file just you have to go to the path scan now you can able to protect your website from almost 2 million plus combinations of attacks we have already created a video on why wordpress get hacked so please watch this video website and to how to protect a website the video also created on that topic if you have any other queries or you want a video guide on a particular topic you can able to comment below